Alright, well I'm Angela Yee and I am here with Crystal Aiken. So I'm so excited to see you perform tonight. Thank you. So you're actually gonna be honoring Mary Mary. How does that feel? Ah, it's a blast. It's exciting. I got the wonderful women that I'm sharing the stage with as well. And and so, you know, it's kind of full circle. You know, they were my judges for Sunday Best. Yes. And so to be able to love on them and let them know that they did a good job. You know what I mean? <laughs> you were on the first season. Right? I was the first season winner, and so to be able to, wow. to sing back to Mary Mary, I mean, man, that's I should be nervous all over. Are they judging me tonight? <laughs> Man, a competition is like, how nerve-wracking was that to be on that first season and not know how long it would last, too, because that was monumental. It was monumental. It was the first season. We were laying the foundation for the many years that have preceded or, or followed, and so, you know, man, it was it was a joy. I was nervous. I'm nervous tonight, no. and so, but a privilege, definitely privileged. I feel like nerves are good, too. They are good. You know, they say that's the Holy Ghost, right? But, yeah. but it really is trusting in, in, <laughs> in God beyond our own flesh and ability, and so I'm I'm, I'm excited. I hope I get off the word. You know, you know what's interesting about your story is education has always been important to yes. you, right? And a lot of times you see artists and they're like, okay, I knew what I was going to do and I was laser focused on that. But you also went to school and got your degree yes, and did all of those things. So yes, what was... What was in your head during that time? You know, um, I'm a registered nurse by trade, and mm -hmm. so uh, when Sunday Best even was presented to me, I was walking the floors of the ER, and so what an opportunity. I knew that, that there was something more beyond the hospital, and so when the doors of Sunday Best opened for me, um, I walked in them truly with faith, um, but I am so grateful that I did do school. I, I right. would tell anybody, if you know that that's your call as well, to go ahead and go to school, get your education, but they can partner together. Yeah, you know what I mean? They can partner together, and so um, I hope that I an example of that. Now, so you also said that you were getting back into music. Yes. So what inspired that and why the break? You know, I, I've been working the whole time. People just may not see me. Mm -hmm. And so, but it really was about new music. And so I was on a label, I was on Verity and RCA, and then I had the opportunity, we pulled away from that. And um, and so it was really about rethinking, rebranding. Uh, the relaunch is a time where you're going through a window of, of time, figuring out who you are. And so the relaunch, I'm, I'm in a place of great joy. <laughs> you I'm seem like it. Place of I great feel you. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> and so that's why I'm here. You know, that's really where it, we're coming out again. It's so that people will see Crystal, who I've been, and where I'm going. And Trouble Don't Last, that's a new <laughs> single. So talk about that, because we need that right now. Absolutely. And people need to be encouraged that joy comes in the morning, and that weeping, it may endure. We're going to be faced with obstacles. We're going to be faced with challenges. But be encouraged that tomorrow, that weeping may endure for a night, but your joy. The joy of the Lord is our strength, and so I hope somebody will know that their joy is coming. Amen. 